welcome back. Today we are talking about the different features of Chatter. Now Chatter has a bunch of different features which we can take advantage of and we're just going to go through them quite quickly and then some of the more nuances and more details around what we can do with Chatter. So at a glance, the different features that Chatter has is poll, which is kind of like a voting sort of question or system that we can pose to members of Chatter where they can vote on different answers. Then we have a post, which is your typical post to a feed. We have a question, which requires a specific answer. And then we have topics, which are annotated by hashtags and are a way of tagging different topics or themes within Chatter. And we can also share posts with a profile or an individual user. So those are some of the very high level and basic features of Chatter. But let's take a look at some of them in a bit more detail. Let's zoom into some of these a little bit more. The first one to take a look at is Chatter Questions. Now Chatter Questions let users ask a question in a Chatter feed in Salesforce and in the self-service experience cloud sites if you're using that product. They're available in chatter feeds, groups, communities, and records. And it is added to the publisher layout by default. Now, chatter questions has a best answer feature, which means that the different answers that you get to a question which you might pose using chatter questions, from those different answers, you can select a best answer. Um, either the moderator can select this or the question asker can select this. And then the best answer status will mean that that best answer will appear at the top of the list underneath that question. Now once a best answer status has been given to a particular answer, it can always be changed later on. Some other features of Chatter that aren't as often talked about is the rich text editor. Now the rich text editor is used to format text in custom fields with the rich text area type. With the rich text editor, you can perform some of the following kind of standard operations within that little interface. These are things like formatting text as bold or italic or underlined or even strike through. You can create bullets and numbered lists. You can change your paragraph indentation. You can use hyperlinks. You can insert images. You can even remove all that formatting altogether. The rich text editor is a fantastic way that you can spice up some of the engagement and some of the interest with your posts and chatter. But there are some restrictions to be aware of. The first one is that the rich text editor is not supported on chatter polls. And you need to know that formatting with the rich text editor can actually be disabled. This also means that it can be enabled if you so choose. To summarize, there's a bunch of different features in Chatter, things like polls, posts, questions, topics, and each of those has their own nuances. Chatter questions has answers and best answer features, and we have the rich text editor as well. I hope that this video taught you something new about Chatter so that you can use it better in your own Salesforce org.